going over our ISO assignment. We're going to practice changing your camera's ISO and taking a correctly exposed photograph. For this assignment, you are to work outside only. Once again, <clears throat> you're only going to work outside. So you are not going to work inside your home or inside a building. Everything is supposed to be photographed outside. You're going to choose a composition that has both a foreground, a middle ground, and a background. It's going to be much easier for you <clears throat> to use a tripod for this assignment because of the long shutter speeds. Everything has to be correctly exposed, so I don't want to see the, your images over or underexposed. Our camera settings are the following. You're going to place your camera in aperture priority. You're going to choose a full f-stop, and I recommend using f1.4 to f1.5. You're going to use the same f-stop on all outside photographs. So for instance, <clears throat> if you're at f5.0, everything in your table is going to say 5.0. The shutter speed is going to change but the f-stop will remain the same. So remember, once again, you'll be taking one photo, you're gonna be taking 10 photographs. Each photograph <coughs> will be exactly the same. You'll be changing the ISO on your camera. So when you take your um, daylight photographs, you're gonna set your camera on ISO 100, 200, 400, 800 and 1600. And here is the file formatting for your submissions. And <clears throat> let's take a look at your table. Here's our table. And you can <clears throat> make a copy. So you go file, make a copy, and put it on your own Google Doc. And then after you have your copy and you've uploaded your, your inputted your information, then you'll be going File, Download PDF. Notice we have item 11, which has our file name <coughs> for this table that you will be submitting. The photograph names 01 underscore ISO underscore last name dot JPEG. I will only be taking JPEGs, not PNG files, not PDF images of your files. I want to see JPEG files. For submission, you're going to complete the one table, which is right here, and submit 10 JPEG photographs in the correct file formatting. Here's the formatting right here, and I also listed it again under file name. Let's go ahead and review some examples. <clears throat> here's a setup. And here's the same um, flower at different ISOs. And then we can see here's student examples. We have Jocelyn's. Now, these are just screenshots. You're going to be submitting 10 individual photographs. <clears throat> we can see Jordan's. And please look at the rubric for the grading and how we're going to be doing this. So our table is worth one point. Our file and formatting, and I'm looking at you're photographing the same scene using the same f-stop. You photograph that same scene again at night or in low light. <clears throat> All images must be in focus. All images must be correctly exposed and they must be photographed outside and compo the composition must have a foreground, a middle ground, and a background. 